you got the MVP on here. Conference tournament. Jesus. <laughs> Don't go in there. Please. You're my player. That's all it takes. You're my coach. Sheesh. Again, we have uh, Coach Jones in the middle, Max Mahoney to the right, and Walter White to the left. Any questions? Our first opening statement from Coach Jones. Oh, you know, where do I start? Um, I'm draped by, by two of the two of the best best people, uh, best players I've I've ever coached. Um, I'm really fortunate uh, to be in this position, um, really because I have I have great great kids that are talented kids that really would do anything that we asked them to do. Um, you know, it's all about them. They they put us in this position, and I'm just here for the ride. I enjoy every minute of that game, coaching that game, and, and trying to put them in a position where they could be successful. But you know, really, it, it goes to them, not to, to not to our staff, and they know that. Questions for the players? Uh, how did the whole game challenge you in the post early game? It seemed like you couldn't really, I guess, get into that position. Yeah. yeah, it took me a little bit to get some rhythm going. Um, I think they were sending two. I just wasn't making great, great decisions. But I think after the first, you know, eight minutes of the game, I came into the media, got some feedback, and started, things started going. Physicality on rebounding, like yeah, yeah, they they come hard. Um, they come hard with intent. Um, we knew coming into this game that that's what they were going to do. So we really focused on uh, you know boxing out and ripping down as many boards as we could. I thought we had a lot of guys step up in that department. Uh, guys like Jonas Harper came in, you know, ripping down boards, um, and that just you know really helped us. Really helped us get out in transition as well. It's tough. It's tough to win in this place. How would you, you guys held on at the end? Yeah, you know, I thought Coach did a great job of preparing us for that. Um, you know, he told us yesterday uh, just to embrace it. You know, it's going to be loud. Um, we knew it was going to be loud. It was going to be us against the world in here. But, you know, I thought we came in, stayed composed, and we need to stay composed and got the job done. Walter, you're supposed to throw out. I mean, when did the game really shift, in your opinion? Um, probably we came out in the second half. We came out really focused. Like, we made sure this for the first four minutes were going to be the, the four minutes that we set the tone that we were going to come, play, play, be the aggressor. Get on the 50 50 balls, and grab down, rip down rebounds like we were trying to do because they're a great rebounding team. And uh, that's, I think it was right when the start of the second half we came out. Those first four minutes was, was crucial right before that media timeout. Was three pointers pick and roll? Was that the key to, the key to winning? Uh, well, because they sink down on Max and then they, they'll play off certain guys. And that's kind of what we used. We, we set screens on the weak side to get guys open for threes. And it was just play inside out. That's what we've done all year. And that's it, it came into play today. You guys have them four threes this year. This tonight, that's their lowest of the year. How'd you do it? Yeah, uh, got to give credit to coach again. But this is just a game plan. Um, you know, we wanted to limit the amount of shots they even took, not even made. Um, we know they're a great three-point shooting team, especially in their gym. Um, and when they start making threes, they get really good. Um, things start working for them. So we try to take that part of the game away. What's it feel like to be the champ? <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Can't even put it into words. Yeah. It's unbelievable. I'm yeah. so proud of this team and. We we faced so much adversity throughout the years, and then we came out on top. I I, I just can't even put it in words. Yeah, I feel the same. You know, we've come a long way. Um, long way. Last year, <laughs> long there's way. been some dark moments. Dark, <laughs> dark moments, you know. Um, but there's losing games early this year. Last year we finished second to last in the in the conference. But I thought, you know, a win like tonight's um, win the uh, win the whole league shows how far we've come as a program. How long will it take to sink in if you guys are playing in the tournament? I, I, I'm not sure it's oh, no. yet. Not but, yet. Not yet. Uh, we'll see. We'll see for sure. I'm, I'm just excited for another opportunity to keep playing in March. Yeah. You guys are going to the tournament. Uh, you won't have any fans in there. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's, that's why. What's that going to be like? It'll be interesting. It'll be, it'll be interesting. You got to bring your own energy. Um, that's what we focus on in practice is bringing our own energy. Um, whether it's a hostile crowd or a crowd that's for you or no crowd at all, you have to, you know, Stick to your game plan and do what you got to do to win the game. Have you ever played in a, in a game like this is going to be? Never. Summer league? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe like, I don't know. It might be. It might come in our favor. Well, it's been, it's, it'll be like a scrimmage. scrimmage yeah. Yeah. We, we, have, we, have, scrimmage. So we have this close scrimmage, and it, ha it happens. Uh, but right now, we're more, you know, we're just happy that we're, that we're going. And uh, I could care less if there's there's anybody in the gym. Yeah. If we're there playing in the tournament, we're gonna be happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Coach, is, is there a uniqueness to it though, with all the uncertainty kind of up? No, I'm not. I'm not answering any of those questions right now. I'm just ecstatic to be playing. Absolutely. We'll worry about that tomorrow. Right now, let's just be the champs. <laughs> yes, sir. Anything else? Thank you, guys.